this is deepika patel and welcome to the vedic mathematics class so let's see what we have to discuss today and we have discussed the addition table and we have also seen the carry numbers and numbers non carry numbers and we have seen the single digit addition as you remember from the dasha dasham sha method okay or in english we can also say the dropping tens method okay and next we have also seen the double plus single digit addition in both the carry and non carry numbers okay next we have seen the double plus double digit addition and i have given you the homework also so in this addition we have seen the only tens place carry number and we have to discuss now in this class we will discuss t double plus double addition but in this the one place and the tens place they are both the carry numbers okay so we will see both tens and ones place numbers which are carry numbers okay so let's just do the quick revision with me of our previous classes which we have learned then we will move forward okay so as you remember the addition table i have told you just go through the table and learn the end numbers and you have to just uh, like if i ask you 8 plus 8 you have to just in your mind like the end numbers will be 8 plus 8 will be 6 okay so next we have see the seen the dasham sha or dropping tens or we can also say the line addition method and we have also seen the vilokanam sutra method that is the end number concept okay now we will see double plus double addition digit addition so let's quickly practice previous example then we will move forward to our next our class okay our today's class so we have seen the like if we if i take this example 4 8 plus 4 so we have seen this double plus single digit addition this is double number and this is single digit number okay so what is the answer yes the answer will be 52 why because 8 plus 4 is 12 and the end number is 2 and 4 will be increased by 1 so this is 52 okay next we have seen 48 plus let's say Five, fifty-four. Okay, so we have seen this example also. Like, what is the answer? The answer will be one hundred two. Why? Eight plus four, as you see, is twelve, and the end number will be two. So two here, and five plus four is nine, and nine will be increased by one. So this will be ten. So one hundred two. Okay. So in this example, as you can observe, like this. Four and eight, five and four. So in this, eight and four will be the carry number because after adding this number, we obtain twelve. Okay, but five and four will be the non-carry number. Why? Because five plus four we got nine. Okay, so this is the single digit. So now we will see how we can add fastly the if we have the tens place and ones place both the carry numbers okay so let's see so let's take a simple example like if we have 64 plus 46 so what will be, how we will do it okay so as you see the end number will be zero so we have to increase the after adding this number we have to increase the increase by it one okay So six plus four will be ten, and the it will be increased by one. So it will be one hundred ten. Okay. So ten plus one eleven, and the end number will be is zero. So let's say if we have forty nine, and if we have ninety four. Sorry, let's take ninety nine. 
So what will be the answer? Yes, the answer will be 148. How you can solve it? 9 plus 9 is 18. Okay, so the 8 will be the end number and 1 will be the carry. So 9 plus 4, you have to add just, you have to just add the number 13. Yes, okay. And 13 plus 1 is 14. So this is the answer. Okay, let's solve two or three more questions. Let's have 48 and 64. So what will be the answer? Just tell me. You, if you see the question, you just have to answer, okay? 82 plus 28. 55 plus 64. Okay, so let's solve this. So what will be the answer? Yes, the answer will be 112. What will be the answer? Yes, the answer will be 110. What will be the answer? Yes, the answer will be 549. So, okay, so I'm taking here the non carry digit number. So, 6511, and this will be the 119. Okay, so how we solve this? 8 plus 4, 12. 2 is the end number. Okay, and 6 plus 4 is 10. So, 10 plus 1, 11. So 112, 2, 8, 10, 1 is the carry and 0 will the add num end number, okay, 2 plus 8 is 10 and the 1 will be the, 1 will be add to the 10, so this will become a 110, okay, and this is the simple number, okay, so I know you can solve this, okay, so let's take one more example, let's practice because this math is all based on practice, okay, so let's take more examples. Let's see if we have 98 and we have 94. And next number 90. Let's take 95. And let's take 88. 88, okay. Next, we have 47 and 47. Next, we have 76 plus 84. Okay. So, let's solve. So, what will be the answer? Yes, you know. 192. Next. What will the, this is 88, okay? This is 88, okay? So what will the answer? Yes, the answer will be 183. Next, we have 47 plus 47. The answer will be, this is simple. 94 and we have okay the answer will be 160 okay so how we can solve this 8 plus 4 12 ka 2 okay 9 plus 9 18 1 plus so 192 okay next we have 8 plus 5 13 the end number will be 3 okay so 8 plus 8 16 17 and then 18 okay so this is simple, 94, and this is also simple. The answer will be 160, okay? So let me give you some questions so you can do at home, okay? So I'm giving you like 10 or 12 questions. So you have to solve at home, okay? But remember, just do not use your pen, paper, or finger. Just do it in your mind, okay?
79 plus let's take 69 let's see how quickly you solve this Seventy-eight plus eighty-nine. Next, we have ninety-nine plus eighty-seven. Next, we have seventy-nine plus eighty-one. Next, we have eighty-seven plus ninety-seven. Next, we have ninety-nine plus. Eleven. Next we have one nine plus nine one. Okay. Next we have seventy nine plus sixty eight. We have forty eight plus ninety five. Okay. So you have to solve all these questions, but just do not use pen or paper. Okay. pen paper and also do not use your finger just do it in your mind and let's see just observe your calculations and observe your solutions and in how many minutes or seconds you can solve all these problems okay so this is all for today and the in the next class we will discuss the triple digit addition so keep watching keep learning thank you for joining the class thank you again